guys, Stu here. Uh, I've just come out on my bike today. Uh, I thought I'd try out a new gas stove. Never had a gas stove before, I've always done um, hexi blocks. And yeah, I just thought I'd uh, document it as well. Uh, kind of like to go along with um, on a wild camp and things like that. But uh, yeah, uh, coming down on the bike. Uh, there's my stuff there. Uh, put my jacket down so I've um, got something to sit on because I forgot to bring something. Uh, and the stove that I've got, well, the stove thing I've got is a uh, Coleman and it's kind of like a pocket rocket as well, which seems okay. But, um, I was trying, I was at home earlier on and I was trying to get a sp I'm um, trying to get it to work, but it's like the spark didn't work or something. But yeah, there's the um, the Coleman 250. Yeah, there you go, self sealing. Uh, like I say, I've never never used them before, so uh, and then I got this off of eBay. Uh, it was a pound, so pretty cheap. Obviously from Hong Kong. And it comes out and it's basic one for spins around as well. There you go. Obviously all the little bits flick out. Obviously everybody's probably used one before anyway. I'm probably just the old school person here. Yeah. Yeah. Alright. Uh, let me just try and I'll be back with you in two seconds. I'm just going to fit it on there and then try and sort the tripod out. See you in a second. So yeah, like I said, the little bits come out. Hopefully you can hear me. All that noise is traffic on the motorway just behind me. Yeah. Loads of fuel in there. Yeah, I can smell it right now as well. Ready. I'll do a description on the book tap in a minute about what I've got and what I've brought. Try to get it to light first. It doesn't work for it then. I'm not that fussed with that. This one out works. Give myself a brew. I have no idea how long this takes to boil. So. Never had one before, like I said. Yeah, while that's boiling, I'll show you guys what I've got in the bag also. Right then, so, like normal, bring my first aid kit. Obviously I've got my gloves for my bike as well. Brought um, some egg out with me as well, just so then, um, in case it gets a bit cold, use it as a scarf. Brought my hat, a pair of gloves, just in case it gets a bit cold, got a bit more of a lining in gloves. Brought out some juice, just in case I wanted some juice some wet wipes uh, obviously me thing because I thought you know just in case the striker didn't work put my cup which is an enamel cup uh, it's all right it's pretty good I've had it for a while now uh, obviously my water bottle just an aluminium one I know some people are probably going to say that I could use this on top um, and like just burn the water in that but 
I can't. I've never really done that one before. So I mean, if somebody wants to comment, you know, is it safe? Is it not? You know, I don't know. But yeah, we've got some um, coffees, uh, which I'll be using in a minute. And in here, I've got my army baseball cap, and I've just got a fleece in there as well. It gets a bit nippy in a bit. And the top here, I have my mobile. Then I have my iPod as well. Oh, which I forgot to mention. Me should be. Yep, my headphones are in the back there. But yeah, that's that pocket. Got a little carabiner on the back there. So I can get that close. I don't think it'll fall out. I've got a light on there. But when obviously it gets a bit dark, so it'll be dark in about an hour's time. In this pocket, I've got my light, uh, I've got a striker steel, um, got emergency whistle with temperature gauge and uh, compass. I've uh, got my light for my bike, I've got my pump as well, and a couple of tools in there. But yeah, um, yeah, well, yeah, that's done quite quick, that has. It's um, boiling already, so. I think I'm just going to leave it at that. I presume you just turn it all the way round. And if that's going to be a bit hot, which it is. But yeah, what the hell? I'm quite impressed with that. I'm going to just get my um, cup back out. I'll just set you guys back down in a sec. Everybody's probably going to be like, oh, well, you know, why don't you just use the um, use this pot? But I find it obviously gets a bit hot around the room, then you can't really drink your brew like for a while. So I'll yeah, just like to be able to pick the cup up as well. I mean, that's that's way too hot that is to even pick up. Back in the bag. Yeah, yeah. yeah I've forgotten my spoon. <laughs> uh, never fear. Got a uh, Allen tool. Yeah, be alright. Clean ish. But yeah. So, jobs are good. Well, that's quite a nifty bit of kit that is. Yeah, I, d I don't know how long the um, how long it will last for. Like the um, fuel that's in there. I don't know if like you get like a certain amount of you know like hours or whatever with it or you know whatever else. But yeah, it's um, it's quite good. Good bit of kit. Yeah. Obviously, getting dinners and stuff as well. I'm probably gonna half my time of what it was with the hexi, um, hexi box, the hexi stove. Um, yeah, I'm quite impressed with that. Uh, like I said, that was a pound on eBay. The uh, the uh, gas um, thing was uh, five pound, I think it was five 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 fifty something like that on eBay as well. So both pretty good. You know, six pound. I got myself a cooker there. It's like with the hexi blocks, they're uh, three pound every time I'm to um, like get a new pack of hexi, hexi cubes. But um, yeah, but obviously you know it gets gets a bit to the point where it gets a bit expensive and stuff. But I'm kind kind of thinking that this might last me a bit longer, like being how quick it is and how good it is. But I mean I might be wrong, you know. But yeah, got myself a brew. Alright, talk to you guys in a bit. Ciao. Back again. Just made myself another brew because it's obviously so quick and I'm a bit thirsty. Um, it's kind of got a bit uh, chilly now, so I've got my, um, my hat, smog on, and my um, uh, fleece. Uh, yeah. I'm going to um, kind of ride out of these woods. Um, like in the dark, should be dark sometime soon. Um, yeah, I'm gonna try and get out again soon for a wild camp. Um, got a couple of new bits of kit that I'm gonna try out. 
got um, the Galette uh, self, in, uh, self inflating mattress which I want to kind of try on. Um, yeah, I can't think what else I've got. I know I've got a couple of bits, but I can't think what they was now. But um, yeah, I really want to try out that mattress because it seems like you know, a bit comfy and stuff. You know, must be better than sleeping on the floor. Um, but yeah, like I say, I was just out for a bike ride today. Uh, yeah, you know, main reason, well, main purpose was to see how the um, Coleman uh, worked out, and yeah, I'm really impressed with that. You know, that's still got steam coming off of it. Don't know if you can see. Yeah, you can just about make out. But yeah, I'm really impressed with that. And yeah, I mean, the only thing that doesn't work is this clicker thing. But it doesn't matter really about that. I mean, I've you know I've got a fire steel and stuff on me, so you know that should work. Um, but yeah. Apart from that guys, that was the little short video that I wanted to do, um, short video I wanted to do, just saying, um, yeah, you can see how it works, but like I said, try and get out again soon, and yeah, see you guys later, peace out, subscribe, like, cheers guys, see ya.